to Project Drive Safer Now. Our Katie Crowther is live in Milwaukee's Bayview neighborhood where city leaders just announced new construction to reduce reckless driving. Katie, of course, we took that uh, press conference live. A lot talked about there. Yeah, Simone, I'm here in Humboldt Park along Oklahoma Avenue near Pine Avenue, a very busy area, very busy park. And I actually used to live in this area and walk my son in a stroller right here along o Oklahoma on the sidewalk. And I remember being alarmed at how fast these cars would zip by us. And I can tell you that I uh, started avoiding this area because of it. So this is an effort to change that for people still living here. It's a bump out or bumper uh, to prevent cars from passing and speeding by in that right bike lane. It's close to the sidewalk and when crossing the street, it gives pedestrians a little more buffer between the sidewalk and traffic. There are also some of these being put in the middle of the road. They're bigger and because they're in the middle, they're known as refuge islands for pedestrians to stand on while crossing the street. There will be signage added to these to alert drivers and pedestrians of these new additions on the road. You'll notice them here on Oklahoma between Clement and Howell. This is mainly being paid for by money allocated to Milwaukee through the American Rescue Plan Act. This area in particular is Alderwoman Marina Dmitrievich's district, who she has been very vocal about the need for more traffic safety measures here specifically. This is a perfect intersection because it shows you where there's a nearby school. There's a number of schools here, obviously a very, very busy park that's beautiful on this fall day a playground, a beer garden, right? We want our city to be full of activity for everyone to feel welcome. However, uh, recently we've seen that on this street in particular, traffic speeds have gone up, people are passing on the right, and there's even times where I alter my path. Uh, we've had accidents and we've started to begin the process to calm traffic. Now, what's being done here will be done on stretches of busy roads near parks and schools throughout the city, including further south on Oklahoma, on the north side near Butterfly Park and Sherman Park, and near Riverside High School in Milwaukee's River West neighborhood. I'll have much more. We're going to go take a look at some of the ones in the middle of the road so I can get you a good shot of those and just show you some of the other work being done here. But again, these calming traffic measures, a good first step, and I'll have more coming up tonight at 5. For now, we're Reporting in Milwaukee's Bayview neighborhood, Katie Crowther, TMJ4 News.